Later in the evening, protests have been pretty quiet throughout national, uh, this National Convention week. And tonight we're learning about a new protest, this one at the Big Bend Power Plant in Apollo Beach. Our Jacqueline Inglace is live in Apollo Beach with the details on the app. Jacqueline? Right now you can see that sheriff's deputies out here have cleared out what was left of this protest. We had about 100 people out here for about an hour. Most of them were from the Environmental Action Agency Earth First. Others on this bus over here are occupiers that were bussed in who wanted to show their support. Mobile coal mining. When it comes to mountaintop coal mining. They are claiming that this year's RNC was funded by millions of dollars in corporate payoffs by corporations that include Tico Energy, Chevron, and ExxonMobil. This is the dirtiest power plant in Florida. Uh, we are here destroying our communities and coal money is destroying our democracy. Just a few minutes ago I got off the phone with a spokesperson for Tico who told me these claims are actually have no basis for these claims. She was telling me that over the past year they've spent millions of dollars to cut the emissions by this plant. They're, they've now cut them in half. She also says this is one of the cleanest plants across the country. But the interesting thing about these protesters being here today blocking the roadways is that we had a ton of truck drivers that were going to make coal deliveries to these plants. They were not able to make it in. They're still out on US 41 parked on the sides of the roads or in parking lots or at gas stations. For now, we're live in Apollo Beach. Jacqueline Inglace, ABC Action News.